We are now ready to put the finishing touches on the artificial intelligence of our turret, so let's do that right now. Currently, when I run my game, the cube is the one that is acting like the turret and is trying to detect me, and of course, when I'm hiding away from him, for example, behind this cube, it will say item in the way cube. Now, let's get this same done for our turret, so let's grab the temporary turret or the cube, basically, and uncheck its script then go back to our turret and select the turret body and let's attach our turret control strip to that in fact we already have it attached it is just turned off so let's check that box to turn it on now we will notice some strange things as we play our game right now Right now, of course, it says out of range because we are out of range for the turret, but then when I get closer, it starts moving. However, it does say item in the way turret body. So the body of the turret is in the way of the collision. However, our script still works. Now that's a little iffy and a little weird. So let's see what's going on. If I look at my turret from the side, you can see that both my center point as well as my pivot point are inside of the turret body and that basically means as soon as we try to detect collision out of the turret body it will hit the turret body first now this could in some cases seriously miss up your script so but there's an easy pretty easy fix to do that we can do to um, solve this problem and if you go to uh, where usually the tags are you can select also the layer of what group the game object is attached to. Now layers can serve all kinds of purposes for example when you have uh, water mesh then of course you can tag things as water or something like that but in this case let's uh, check the ignore raycast group and this is a predefined layer within unity and it will basically help you as a game object to ignore raycast. Now in this case we only want this applied to the head of our turret so don't click yes change the children of it also that means everything down the line in the hierarchy will also be ignoring raycasts we might not want to do that so let's click no this object only. Now when I run my game let me get in closer proximity of our turret here and as you can see it simply says player detected now that's a lot nicer also it might still collide with the guns on the side if I get real close for example you can see it does say in the way of the barrel but in this case it doesn't really mess us up much so I think our uh, script is pretty nice the range is a little short for this size of turret so we can change that to say for example 20 now let me uh, take this cube here that we have far away or in fact let me just move the turret closer instead of the cube see if our hiding script works on this turret as well it says player detected when I hide away it says item in the way cube it still rotates though so we have a little error going on I was wondering why it rotated even though its body was in the way and I think I know what the problem is let's open up our turret control script we forgot to return false when it is out of line so here it says the collider but we're not returning false so there you have it that's why it was still rotating let's play our game now and right now the cubes in the way so it stopped rotating itself very nice as soon as we sneak up to it though it again detects the player and if I'm fast I might stop it from rotating because now the guns are in the way so the sensor cannot see us which in this case is fine with me but if you don't want this you can also select the guns and then put them on the ignore raycast layer as well okay perfect so that's working for now our artificial intelligence is done now let's continue on and make this turret fire at us